Hi everyone! In this video, we're going to show you how you can remove a person from a photo using an app called Snapseed. We can download Snapseed for free for both iOS and Android, and I'll leave the download link for Snapseed in the video description down below. So let's start right away. Let's open the Snapseed application on our iPhone or Android phone, and then import the photo from which you want to remove the person. As you can see, I want to remove this person from the photo, so I'll open the toolbar by clicking here, and then scroll a little bit down until you can see the double exposure option. Click on the button, and we're now in the double exposure mode. Our next job is to add the same photo one more time, so click on this little photo gallery option. That's going to open our camera roll, and just add the same exact photo. I now have two same photos in my editor, and now you want to follow my steps carefully. Move the second photo a little bit to the right or the left side. We want to move it just a tiny bit until we can see two people standing next to each other. After you do this, you want to click on the opacity option and then drag the slider all the way to the right until the opacity of the second photo becomes 100%. Now we'll start erasing the person. Click on this button at the top of the screen and then find the View Edits button. When the edits open, We'll click on this double exposure layer right here, and then tap on this brush icon at the center. I'm going to zoom into the photo a little bit, and then start brushing over your person. You want to use your finger and just brush over the person in your photo, and you will see the person disappear after every brush. I won't brush over his legs, because I have the rock and the hill next to them, so we'll use a little trick to remove them at the end of this video, so make sure you follow until the end. If you've made a mistake and brushed a little too much like I did, then you want to lower the brush value from a 100 to 0 and then start brushing over your mistake. I have to remove the hand from the first photo, or the first layer, so just increase or decrease the value of the brush until you've erased the person and other things that are unnecessary. We're almost finished, but we have to erase the legs from the rock, and we'll do that by repeating the process one more time. So open the tools, then double exposure. And now we have to add the same exact photo one more time. When you add the photo, just zoom in a little bit because we will have to place the hill part of the photo over the legs. Then increase the opacity of the second photo to 100% once again. Now we have to go over to our edits. Then select the double exposure option one more time. Click on the brush and then start brushing over the legs in order to remove them from the photo. I'll speed up this part a little bit, and I'm left with the photo without the person. The last step that you want to do is to see if you have any blemishes or spots that are left over. You can easily erase those by going over to the tools, then select the healing tool, and then brush over those spots in order for them to disappear. Once you're happy with the edits, you can save your photo to the photo gallery. And that's how you can remove a person from a photo using the powerful Snapseed application. If this video was helpful, then leave a like on it, and I'll see you soon.